Hi, I'm Andy Duncan, Open RAN RF and Digital Platform Development Manager, Group Networks Architecture at Vodafone. We have been a leading driver of Open RAN since 2017 in our ambition to move from proprietary to open platforms in our RAN networks. To do this, we have driven hardware and software disaggregation, enabled a broader vendor ecosystem with more innovation, competition, while working across industry bodies such as the Telecom Infra Project and ORAN Alliance, as well as the rapidly maturing vendor ecosystem. As we evolve our open RAN platforms to support not just multiple technologies, but increasingly bandwidth hungry services, such as 5G massive MIMO, we require increasingly powerful and more efficient compute platforms. This is achieved through acceleration of the L1 stack. Our primary requirement is to achieve this while maintaining our open platform objectives. A design that is open and flexible across chips, interfaces, hardware and software. A design that is complete and ready to go to market. And a design that scales without adding power and cost. As part of Mobile World Congress Barcelona 2023, we're excited to share that Vodafone, Dell and EdgeQ are demonstrating a state-of-the-art, software-defined, massive MIMO open RAN solution with an objective to deliver new levels of performance while lowering cost and power efficiency in the compute platform. The demo comprises an end-to-end -end 64T, 64R capable massive MIMO system working live on the Vodafone stand, fully open and software-defined following ORAN specifications and supporting an ORAN 7.2 front hall split. This collaboration between Vodafone, Dell and HQ demonstrates a multi-vendor compute platform, including a COT server, an HQ inline L1 accelerator and third-party L2, L3 software stacks, supporting the full Massive MIMO implementation. To help you appreciate some of the numbers behind the demo, let me take you through the demonstration. The graphs on the right show the user traffic of two beams. You will see the user traffic throttle up and down per beam. Each of the two beams shown can support four downlink layers across multiple users with a constellation of 256 QAM. A single HQ L1 accelerator chip exceeds five gigabits of aggregate throughput, all the while consuming less than 15 watts. The collaboration between Vodafone, Dell and EdgeQ validates the aspirations of OpenRAN. As an operator, we can assemble advanced hardware and software solutions to drive new industry benchmarks and evolution of next generation OpenRAN compute platforms in line with our objectives.